Hey, welcome to a new video. Today we are doing a little car part install on the Focus ST. This is a spring, clutch spring, Let's see what it's called, STRS clutch spring factory perch. This is the pre-installed one that uh, costs more money, but uh, it's easier to deal with. Now there's no instructions with it. So I had to print them online. Doesn't require any tools apparently. So what I'm gonna do is measure how, the, how high the clutch is now and you know, fill it and then swap it out, put it on and then fill it again. See how it, see how it feels. Is this thing right here? So here's the clutch pedal. So we're gonna push on it and see how it, see how the spring moves. Okay, do it one more time, let's see this. Oh yeah, I have never looked at that. That is actually pretty cool looking. All right, you got the gist. You got the gist of that. Get the gist of that. Yeah. How it felt. Okay. Now let's um, find these instructions that I printed over here from Stita. This is a Stita part. Simple instructions, apparently. Right. You better read. <laughs> What's step one? Oops. Park your car on a flat surface and engage the emergency brake. Check. Depress the clutch pedal and remove the factory clutch spring assembly by unseating it from the bracket that it's seated in. Wait, so we gotta push it down and then pull yeah. it out? But that compre that, hmm, okay. It may be easiest to push up on the lower spring bucket and push the assembly towards the center console. See figure one for reference. Yes, yes. Check. Got it. Install the Cita clutch spring assembly in reverse order. <laughs> As a side note, uh, we, we don't do this for a living. This is just for fun. It's not really fun. And this is a daily driver. We drive this to work every day. So, follow at your own risk, I guess. <laughs> okay, let's, let's, I don't know what, what they're talking about here. Let's see here. Push it inward. Push it. Console is what it said. Toward the center console. So that way. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah. I mean that's expanding it out. That's compressing it. Uh, it's really tight. I don't know what it's talking about. Oh no, it's not. Is it gonna spring off and hit me in the face? Probably. Hmm. Wait. It comes up. Oh. Yeah. It just pops that off. Needs to slide up it just now. pops off. Okay. Two. Um. What's the difference? I mean, this one looks... This one looks as fat. The springs look narrower than that one. Yeah. Hmm. So, this one's gonna be easier to push? I think so. I don't know. Don't know. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we just learned. We put... I cannot push this one down with by my hand. I mean, I can a little bit, but check out the Steedo one. I can actually do that one. Interesting. All right, install time. There's the new one. Go back up where. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Like that. Like that. Twist this around. Uh, hmm. I missed a hole. That's so greasy. Okay, now let go. Give it a couple pushes, see what you... Make sure it's in there, dude. Oh, it's 
way softer. And there's like clay in it a little bit here. It looks a little shorter now. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. See, there's clay in it here where before there wasn't. And then. Okay, I'm going to give the clutch pedal a shot. I mean, it still feels stiff. I thought it was gonna be like really loose. I was kind of nervous about it being a really soft clutch spring. Oh wow, it's so much shorter. It's easier to, huh. That'll work. Okay, yeah, what's your opinion? Cause you were the it's one that was- Shorter. Shorter? Yeah. yeah. So what they say is you can better tell where the clutch engages with this spring. Because the, the stock Ford one has lots of play in it. And it's not very linear. You can't really tell. So, um... We'll hmm. see after we drive After we go for a drive. Yep. Okay, we're going to go for a little little test drive real quick. Um, to see how this clutch swing feels. Shorter. It's shorter, but I gotta get used to where, where it where it takes up now. Um, What I sh should have done is gone for a drive, came back, swapped it out, and went for a drive again. Because now I don't know if it feels better. I would know. You would know? I can drive it every day. Okay. good before but I'm gonna pull over and let the um, daily driver drive it okay so it's much shorter is it yeah. let's see how you feel driving yeah you don't have to let out very far yeah and it it's takes really up really short takes up right away yeah it's weird how a little spring does that. I, I never knew that until I read about it. You still have to let out, especially sitting in traffic. You can tell, definitely, because I do drive in traffic a lot. There's lots of red lights. You mean like you don't have to let like out? You don't have to let out as far. Yeah. I would always put it in neutral because. Because you got to push. Because it's so high. So and you got to push so in. down. So yeah. Super short. So that's it for the clutch spring assembly install. Super easy. Um, right now it's on sale for like $75, I, I do believe. I think it's a huge upgrade that we're going to really enjoy. I think she's going to really enjoy it because she sits through a lot of traffic. Yep. So it should be a real winner. Go to Stita.com to find that. Uh, thanks for being here. Make sure you subscribe, hit the bell, like, all that stuff. Until the next install video, bye-bye. <laughs>